Okay, I just got the Windy Day video. I'm going to try to show everybody what it looks like to have Windy Day since it's only available on the Moto X to show you how it looks and acts through glass. So I'm going to launch it again. Normally you don't have to hit the replay button. You just tap on the hat that appears on your home screen, but since I already watched it, I have to tap on a replay. Here we go. Oh, okay. So you can see it flying around there. We'll turn it here. Uh oh, I lost it. All right. And basically, it's augmented reality. You just follow it around. The wind's blowing it around. Whoop, there she goes. Oh, gotta keep following it. Oh. Now I gotta keep this on here for a minute. Out comes a little mouse. He's like, hey, look. Oh my god, there's a hat. I'm gonna go chase that hat. And the music starts up. Make sure the volume's up so you guys can hear it. He's like, huh, I'm a mouse, and here's a hat. I can put this hat on. I kind of look like Speedy Gonzales. Uh-huh. Oh, no, the wind comes. All right. Then you get the picture. Now we spend the next couple minutes chasing the hat. The graphics actually look very well on this, and that's what really what it's trying to do. It's really supposed to highlight the Moto X's Adreno 320 GPU to show that you know graphics don't have to suck on a smartphone, especially when a lot of people said, "Oh, the Moto X has last year's processor," you know, since it only had a what a dual core crate. So basically now the wind picks up and I have to follow it around again and it's going to get real crazy in a second. I lost it when I first did it. That's it. I mean, it, it's, is this something you're going to do more than once? Is it something you're going to do multiple times? I would say probably not. It's more or less just showing what the platform can do. Just showing that the graphics can be good. Actually, the graphics, like I said, the graphics are pretty amazing. I'm, I'm impressed. Uh-oh. So I'm trying to keep this in the glass viewfinder as I'm doing it. So for, for the last like 20 seconds, if you weren't watching the screen, that's my bad. There's a bear with a fish in his mouth. Hat's still there. The bear is no longer there. And the hat is still there. It's getting pretty windy. It's getting pretty windy. Better grab that hat, Speedy Gonzales. Oh no! See, I'm bad at this. You don't pay attention and you lose them. <laughs> yeah. 
All right, so this is where Derek looks like a bozo walking in a circle, looking up and down, trying to find this mouse in his hat. So that's, I wasn't paying attention, and I lost him. You know, the, the demo gods are never with you when you want them to be. You know, kind of like Google today. You know, they lost power 15 minutes before the big announcements. I have no clue where this thing was. <laughs> I assume you can't interact, or can you interact with the screen? Oh, you can interact with the screen, because I'm actually panning it around. So I don't need to sit there and spin, I can sit there and just spin like this. Well, that's interesting to know. Since the demo video showed people walking around spinning in circles, they weren't just spinning a screen. <laughs> well, I'm betting I failed miserably by not watching where it went. Oh, man. Just when you're about ready to give up. You know, I bet that's actually part of the game, if we can call it a game, the storytelling canvas. He's slowly falling back down and tricking you into thinking that you lost it when you, in fact, did not lose the hat and did not lose him. That was just a fail on my part. So feel free to blast me in the YouTube comments for making a mistake, because I know you will. And it's a chicken... And she lays an egg. I wonder what could be inside the egg. It's the hat. And now the hat's chasing him. The end. And that's it. Okay.